Nick speaking and welcome to this battle report. Uh, right, tonight it's Tyranids versus Space Marines, 2,000 points and uh, my list is based around the May painting challenge so I've taken every single model that I've painted in May put it into this list along with a few other models and uh, we're going to face off against Space Marines on my uh, Cities of Death type terrain. We're not going to play, we're going to play normal missions but uh, we're using all of my ruined buildings for a bit of a change. So uh, this is what I have. Um, we've got a Turvagon here, uh, a defence line with the comms relay to give me plus one to my reserves rolls. Uh, three Hive Guard two squads of 10 gene stealers with two brood lords got the turvigon tax 30 gants there we've got a uh, harpy we've got three pods one pod's got the toxicredum one pod's got old one eye and the other pod's got uh, three zone throats one upgraded to the new duma melanti um, and then we've got the venom throats there um, and for space marines i'm playing my son he's going to run over his list we have um 10 stand guard in a drop pod, and then 10 tacticals inside of Rhino, a heavy bolter land speeder, and then we have 10 tacticals um, combat down, 5 on foot, and 5 in the tank. Then we have 6 bikes, a fire thunder cannon, um, terminators, centurions with the grav, and a captain with a storm shield, and a 2 plus armor save at the front. And then Liberian Tigerus with, and then there's Last Cannon Devastators, Scouts with snipers and a missile launcher, and they have camo cloaks, and six assault rings. Okay, so there you go. Uh, we're just about to roll off for the mission. Uh, we're going to set up, and we'll be back for some more. <laughs> Okay, so we're ready to go. Uh, we've rolled and we're playing Big Guns Never Tire and we've got four objectives. We have one objective here, uh, one over there in the Space Marine Deployment Zone. There's one here in this building in the middle and one all the way over this side. Um, I'm currently going second. I've deployed the Turbigon, the Gants, Venom Thropes, the Hive Guard, infiltrated the two squads of uh, Gene Stealers. Uh, he's got the Horror and uh, over in reserve the zone tropes there have got catalyst uh, space marines infiltrated the scouts here i was going to infiltrate my gene stealers here but i couldn't get in they went first so I infiltrated one squad of gene stealers here and one squad of gene stealers there and we have the bike squad and the devastators there the centurions uh, tacticals uh, assault marines more tacticals there thunderfire cannon there and a speeder um, I'm currently going second, so I'm going to grab a dice and see if I can roll to get first turn. Um, the Space Marines have got their drop pod coming in, of course, as well. Right, here we go. A six. Yes, he does it again. Okay, so Tyranny turn one. Okay, so that's my turn one. Uh, the Tervagon spawned 13 uh, Gants, uh, but he was constipated, so he can't spawn anymore. 
the Gantz here just moved up along with the um, hive guard. Everything that basically moved up that had to take rough terrain checks, I got a six inch movement on everything, which is pretty cool. Um, over this side, I just moved up a little bit, used the horror on the Devastator squad, uh, but they passed their leadership. However, the uh, Broodlord here used the horror on the Centurion squad and managed to pin them. Uh, the Hive Guard shot at the uh, Rhino there, managed to wreck it. The guys got out, they weren't pinned, but that was first blood. Um, and that was it. Okay, so we're going to go on now to turn one for the Space Marines and uh, the drop pod's going to come down automatically. Okay, so that was turn one there for the Space Marines. Uh, the drop pod landed here, uh, the 10 stern got got out, shot my turvigon. I lost two wounds, um, great help from being in the building and from Venethroat, so give me the 2 plus save. Um, and then the Devastator squad shot my turvigon, um, but they failed to, to do any wounds. The bikes moved up, rapid fired my uh, gene stealers, I lost uh, one there in the building. Uh, these guys moved up, shot my gene stealers, I lost one. I lost another couple of gene stealers from the assault marines. They did try to assault me, but they were slightly out of range. Uh, the centurions attempted, attempted to shoot, but they could only snap shots. Um, and then the thunderfire cannon came up over here on these gants. Uh, a huge scatter over onto the stern guard. Four died, um, and they found the lead ship, and they were coming running. Uh, the scouts up there tried to shoot my turvigon, uh, but missed. And that was it. So we're going on to now uh, reserves. Just grab my dice. Okay, so we've got the harpy. It's out on a two plus because of the comms relay. Uh, the zone throats on the floor. Zone throats, nope, they're not out. Uh, old one eye, that's out on two plus. And then the toxicrine, that's not out. So just the harpy and old one eye to come. Okay, so that was tyranny turn two. And this is getting a bit bloody here. So, um, I brought the Harpy on over here, I uh, shot uh, the Clusters and his main Strangler at the uh, Scouts, killed a couple of those, uh, they didn't uh, fail the leadership. Then over here I shot at the Stern Guard with the Turvigon and the Gants, uh, I then proceeded to assault them, we're just locked in combat within Synapse range. Did kill a couple of Stern Guard, there's four Stern Guard left. Uh, then what else? Uh, okay, yes, the gene stealers. They moved over this bridge. I assaulted the assault marines. I managed to uh, kill those. Got quite good rending. Over this side of the table, I moved the uh, gene stealers off. Um, and then just to recap, actually, about the psychic phase. I only rolled one on the psychic um, dice. Um, so I tried to do the horror over here, and then I did the horror over there. But I fell with both of them. Um, I then assaulted uh, here the bikes. I killed uh, three bikes, lost a few gene stealers as well. We're locked in combat, three bikes left. Over this side of the table, I uh, brought the pod down here. Actually, it was over there, but did a big scatter, landed there. Uh, the old one I got out, he ran over there. Uh, then I shot the um, uh, Venom cannons at this unit here, did a few scatters. In the end, I only killed one man from here. Um, and then that was it. Uh, yes, okay, so we're looking now at turn two for the Space Marines. Okay, so that was turn two for the Space Marines. Uh, the Terminators did come in from reserve, they tried to come over here, they scattered, mishapped, um, and I got to place them, so I placed them right over in the corner. They did run, just one inch. Speedy came up here, shot my uh, old one eye. Uh, no wounds, however the Devastators did shoot them and uh, got a wound. Uh, then I had focus fire from uh, these marines here, the uh, Centurions and those marines all shot my gene stealers here with the Rude Lord and I lost them all. Uh, over here we did the combat, I didn't uh, lose anything, I killed one bike. Um, and then over here um, I lost four Gants and I killed one marine, we're just locked in combat in synapse range from the Tervigum. The Thunderfire Cannon shot over here at the uh, Hive Guard. Um, got a bit of a scatter, but um, basically just didn't wound me, and when they did wound me, I saved them. Um, so that was it. So, we're looking at my turn three, and uh, reserves, let's have a look. So we've got the Zone Throats, they're out, and the Toxicrine, that's out as well. 
Okay, so that's my turn three. Uh, I brought the toxicrine down up over here, and then over this side I brought down the zone thropes. The zone thropes got out. I tried to shoot warp blast at that, but I didn't get enough uh, uh, warp charges through, so I ended up running them into here. Uh, the pod ended up shooting the scouts, I killed one scout, two left. Then I shot the hive guard up over here, I managed to uh, wreck that. The guys got out, I shot the hive crone at those guys, uh, killed a couple of those, ended up uh, assaulting with the old one eye there, managed to wipe them out, uh, consolidated six inches and I got my regeneration, so I'm back to full strength there. Um, and then over this side of the table I didn't do very well uh, really to be fair I, I shot here with the two pods and the tox screen and uh, I only killed a couple of guys uh, however the gene stealers did get uh, two sixes to rend those bikes killed those and then consolidated up into the building uh, the only other event was these guys here moving up um, yeah, so that is it. Turn three now for the Space Marines. Okay, so Space Marines turn three. Uh, these guys here, they shot and then assaulted my um, Gene Stealers. Uh, I lost the combat actually and uh, I'm starting to run. Um, over here, Tuck Screen took loads of bullets from all of these guys, but thanks to Shrouded, um, I didn't take a single wound. Uh, the speeder went up, back up behind there and the Terminators are making a very slow trundle across the board. Over here we killed one guy each, so we're just locked in combat with one one uh, person each. Well, you can't really call a nid a person, can you? But you know what I mean. Um, and that's it. So, we're now looking at turn four for Tyranids. Okay, so that's my turn four there. Uh, East Zone Thropes did Spirit Leech on uh, the Scouts, managed to kill those. Then I just, um, on the objective there basically, the pod just moved up. Uh, this massive squad of Gants just moved and ran um, towards that objective there. Carried on the assault, we did nothing, so we're just standing there. The Hive Guard shot the Centurions, but they saved everything. The Tox screen took out a good chunk of these Marines here, uh, along with the pod. The Gene Steelers just consolidated. And then the um, Old One Eye, he went up and assaulted the last two Marines that were there. Um, the Harper did pretty well because he targeted the Terminators and they managed to kill three of the Terminators and then they ran off the board. Um, that's pretty much it. So we're moving on now to turn four for the Space Marines. Okay, so turn four for the Marines. Uh, used a few psychic powers, managed to take the pod out um, and then these guys here shot uh, the Harpy did get a wound, uh, th sorry, did get a hit through but didn't wound. Thunderfire Cannon shot my Gantz here, scattered off, went over there, um, tried to, well, uh, hit the uh, old one eye but didn't wound him. And then over here, the ensuing assault, and uh, we did no damage each, so we're still left one person each. Right, okay, so that was it. Uh, coming to the end now, turn five for the Tyranids. Okay, so that was my turn five. Uh, moved all these Gants up over here. Uh, the Harpy I landed, shot the Thunderfire Cannon, but no damage. Um, over here, these uh, Gene Steelers assaulted there. We just locked in combat, just killed one guy each. Uh, the uh, Tox Cream moved up onto that objective. Uh, old one I came up, um, he got pounded in Overwatch with the Psych Power Let's and re-roll everything. Um, but luckily I managed to save a lot of the wounds with my Feel No Pain. Um, but I still took one wound in Overwatch and I lost one wound in the Assault, but I did manage to kill a couple of Centurions there. Um, that was pretty much it, I shot all of my Gants at these guys but didn't kill anything. 
Uh, and then over here, the stern guard finally killed that Gant, so he's just uh, consolidated. Okay, so we're looking at turn five now for the Space Marines. Okay, so turn five there for the Space Marines. The speeder turbo boosted up near that objective, so that's contested. Uh, the lonely stern guard shots assaulted me here, pulled me back, but not quite enough because of well spread out. Uh, I did manage to kill him, consolidated back one inch. Um, however, these guys went through the door and they are contesting that objective. Uh, over this side of the table, we uh, had a combat here. I lost a gene stealer, he lost one of those um, last cannons. And then here we had another assault. Uh, old one I managed to take out the Centurion. Still got the captain left there alone, locked in combat. So this is my objective. And I have line break there because that did land. Um, and of course this is my objective. So we're looking at 8-1 at the moment to Nids. But let's see if the game goes on. A 3. Yes it does. Okay so that was turn 6 for me. Um, I basically managed to shoot out the three guys that were there with the pod and with those uh, Gants. Um, went into this combat here, I managed to kill the one guy there, Tigerius is down to one wound, he took a perils earlier in the game. Over here we continued the assaults here, um, no wounds were done. The Harpy uh, managed to assault and kill the Thunderfire cannon. And then over the other side of the table, um, I failed to get Warp Blast off. I did assault the skimmer, got one hole point off of it. That's still contesting. Uh, okay, so now we're going to move into turn six for the Space Marines. Okay, so turn six there for the Space Marines, not too much to do. Uh, in the assault, uh, the Broodlord, he managed to kill off Tigarius. Um, so that was uh, Slay the Warlord. And then over here we had the combat there, no wounds were done. Over this side the pod shot me here but did nothing. Uh, the speeder moved away from the zone throats, just landed there. Um, that's pretty much it. So, see if the game goes on. It's currently 11 points to 1. Uh, just line breaker for the Space Marines. Uh, let's see if the game goes on. I thought it does. Okay, so that was uh, turn 7 for me. Um, it was pretty much all over anyway, so we've uh, finished the game off, but uh, in my turn I moved the Broodlord down onto that objective, took the Toxicreen in, killed off the Captain, uh, over this side of the table brought the Harpy back over here, managed to take uh, the uh, Speeder out with the Warp Blast, um, and that was pretty much it, so it's just a line breaker there for the Marines. Um, I've got all four objectives, I've got uh, First Blood, Line Breaker and Slay the Warlord. Uh, so we're not going to carry on. But it was a really good game. Um, really enjoyed playing this army. And it was really good actually to get my buildings out on the table as well. So I hope you enjoyed the battle report. And as always, thanks for watching.